Write the net ionic equation for the equilibrium that is established when ammonium iodide is dissolved in water. Okay, so first, let's write the dissolution of ammonium iodide. Okay, so this is the chemical equation for uh, ammonium iodide plus water. I'll make NH3. plus H3O plus uh, plus iodide. So now I'm going to write out the ionic equation. So if we were to write ammonium iodide uh, separated into its ions, it would be NH4 plus plus I minus. Since this water is a liquid, I'm not going to write it uh, in an ionic form. And then this side stays the same. So now I'm just going to cross out my spectator ions. So spectator ions are ions that appear on both sides of the equation. So the only spectator ion here is the iodide. And then I'm going to write my net equation. which is that. So because we have H3O+, plus, this indicates that our solution will be more acidic. and you do something similar with the ammonium bromide. So I'm just gonna... Yeah, sure, I'll do part B as well. Uh, so part B says to write the net ionic equation for the equ equilibrium that is established when ammonium bromide is dissolved in water. So something similar takes place. We have ammonium bromide plus H2O And then I'm going to write out the ionic equation. So the water stays the same.
and I'm going to cross out my spectator ions, which is just the bromine in this case. Then I'm going to write out my net ionic equation. Okay, so again, we have H3O plus. So this solution will be acidic. Okay, so let's look over to what our junior tutor said. They wrote out the dissolution of ammonium iodide. They have the net ionic equation here. Uh, they remove the spectator ions to get NH4 plus, H2O, NH3, and H3O plus. You'll have an acidic solution. And then they do the same thing for ammonium bromide. And again, the solution is acidic. So this solution is correct.